believe. Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, that would make sense. Semis. So loser of this, or winner of this rather, Plays. goes on to play Shaquille O'Field. Sha Shaquille O'Field. Okay, hey, Corey. Or Betty Spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Okay, hello now. What? Is this button check? No, we're going into it. Okay. Going right into it. All right. So, chic peach matchup. Peach usually has the better end of this, right? I think so. I think peach has a better time in the air. Mm -hmm. Especially when Sheik is coming from on top of her. Yeah. Sheik, uh, just in general, just does yeah. not have very good options coming down. Like, the only real option is, like, down air. And that's not even too good? Yeah. Or, like, you upbeat to the ledge. If they don't, you know, if they don't get the timing... If they, if they time it right, then they can just straight up count on the banner. At low percent, uh, she wants to chain a bunch of fares together real quick. Yeah. Uh, but after that, it's really just back air edge guards from the ledge. So I think it's interesting because another thing that a lot of sheiks do is crouch cancel. Yes. That's a big thing. And That's not good against you, Peach. Yeah, as you know, That's crouch cancel so down it, smash really you're playing, hurts. You're, in this match, you're more, more likely playing Peach's game. Oh, no. Dude, frying man. pan. Frying pan, dude. Well, it's, I would say back. the better, uh, the best um, forward smash because it combos. Because a lot yeah. of uh, Peach's aerials are like up, upward hit, hit them up, so it's what a good combo it, starter. It's a uh, racket hits it farthest out, most yeah. horizontal, pan hits it most vertical, and then golf club does like, just, like farthest, right? Yeah. Gotta get that drive. <laughs> the longest the drive. The long drive, dude. Okay, so she uh, JP does take the stop. Uh, he's at very high. Oh, nice back air. Yeah, another thing with this matchup is the turnups. Yeah, they can they're help Sheik. Real pain. In, they can, but they're most of the time they're a real pain in the ass for Because she has no has to use an aerial to stop them. Yeah, I mean, and sometimes you can do really interesting and creative recoveries with that. But a lot of the times when Peach is just slinging them out, it's a, it's you know it's pretty tough. To be able to get back, I know it's I've like seen chic, 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 chic matchup. I know the needles are just deadly. Good to, uh, sometimes good to catch the turnips if you're far enough away. Yeah. Because then you can continue your neutral game. Yeah. Ooh. That umbrella. Wow. That was something I don't think I've ever seen it before in <laughs> my Smash playing career. Peach he tries to run off air, doesn't get it. Cause Peach he's up, away. up the. It's very good. Stage spiking somebody on Battlefield. Nice fair. Okay, so it's, it's still doable, but it's going to be tough. The problem is... Some pretty good neutral game. Is that Sheik does have... Rely a lot on her... Uh, platforms. Yeah, her and... platform movement, and... Peach has a really good way of dealing with platforms. Her up air is really good, and she can oh, no. just float yeah. to this height of the platform, then come in with a neutral air or forward air. Plus, her down smash hits like right at the bottom of the platform, mm -hmm. so you can't yeah. really shark anything from underneath it. Yeah. By the down smash. Yeah, down smash on platform is very Ooh. strong. That was a great dynasty, dynasty combo right there. I love. So he brought it back. Yeah, that, I mean, good on him. Not being phased by that oh. really early kill. Good grab. Early chain grab. Nice dynasty getting the percentage. A nice trade though for the okay. yeah. Good forward there. So now it's pretty much it's pretty even. It's just that she can die a lot easier at these percents. Yeah. Like that. He's got to watch out for the trades. Yeah, because Peach can trade higher up yeah. uh, to a longer percentage. She can. Oh, is that? Yep, that's it. Oh, yep. See, that's the problem. The sniper from the turn up. The Parcheesi sniper. <laughs> The, che the, the cheesiest oh, sniper. The, no, it's the it's the cheesiest of snipes. <laughs> now, I wonder if she wants to play this slower and make Peach come to her, or play more. Because he just needles if he wants to do that. that. That's what I was thinking. So if he wants if he wants to make him come to her, you go to FD most likely because there's no platforms that you can uh, yeah. camp on. All right, going, back back. going right back. Basically saying I can beat you. I just got to play better. He almost better. did. Yeah, I mean that was close. He, he just has he to got play sniped. better. At the, uh, he has to play better at the beginning of the match because at the beginning of the match, uh, Parcheesi was really taking it to him. Mm -hmm. 
Now, I think the problem with um, needle camping and playing very slow as Sheik against Peach is the fact that Peach has those heights where it's Peach just very awkward anything. to yeah. reach. Yeah. But just like with Falco. Mm -hmm. She has those heights where it's just very awkward to reach. You and can't you, really. You basically can't really reach anything. anything. Yeah. yeah. So you just gotta wait and then reset to neutral. Yep. Again. Ooh. What was that, a dot that time, I think. Yeah, I think that time he just upbeat right into it and he hit him at the perfect spot. Yeah. I think it was a little bit of an early upbeat too. I th yeah, I think he could have drifted more and gone underneath. Yeah. Peach just has... Peach has a very underrated, I guess you could say, uh, amount of pressure. Yes, especially with her down smash. Especially with the fact that she can do an aerial in the air and come down with four frames of landing lag. Or even none with la with uh, if that's a flow cancel. I thought it was a uh, I thought flow cancel made it four because it's just basically when you fall down. <laughs> it's true. I don't know if it's four or nine. I thought it was. I thought it was. I think four, it's but four, but what, for some it, reason between I, that, yeah, that's, that's still ridiculous. Four sixtieths of a yeah. second. Yeah, that's and that's on any aerial too. Yeah, yeah. It's so, just and she can come down right with that, and then right into a down smash, right into jabs on a shield, right into a grab or something like that. It's it's insane. She she has a lot of pressure that people don't really uh, they really underestimate. Yeah, and is that's, that a stick trace? Yes. It is. Ooh. Oh, oh. It. yep. Oh. All right, he's gonna have to play it patient. Right, yeah. Oh wow! And he grabbed it back that too. Was... He did, just has to grab ledge. Pretty creative right there. And he's—I think he has one more throw. I think so. Yeah, I think he got four. Oh, no, wow, he got five. Okay. That was—he really took advantage of that though. Yeah, he had a—he got a lot of mileage off that one pull. He really—the best thing to really avoid it is to try to power shield and grab it, or just grab it straight out of the air. You know what I mean? Yeah. But that's hard when she can still do her aerials with the with the turn up. You could switch to Zelda and then just use the reflector too. That's I true, mean. but <laughs> I think that's the best option. That's the most optimal. Oh, oh wow! Yeah. And then, that was a really dominant performance. Is this three out of five or two out of three? It's supposed to be. I mean, it's supposed to be two, but you can't play three out of five. All right, full gentleman of three out of five. Right. That's fine. We're not really. Wait, what time is it? Yeah, we we still have an hour. We, we have, yeah, there's plenty of time. Yeah. Yoshi's. This should be better for Sheik. Yeah. Especially with the lower uh, class zones. Yes, definitely. Because the fair will kill it earlier. But I think this is just a very hard matchup in general. I mean, you don't really see many Sheiks play against Peaches, honestly. And I think it's just for this reason. Like I don't think this matchup is very good. Well, uh, the last time I saw Sheik Peach is really just Mewtwo King against. You know, Mewtwo King doesn't even play Sheik. Yeah, that's what I'm Armada. saying. Mewtwo plays Marth. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Mewtwo King plays Marth. When he when when given you know when he plays against Peach, he usually goes Marth. So, I'm, yeah, I'm not sure. I think this matchup just might be bad for Sheik. Yeah. And after that, that's when you ask yourself, do you put time into, into the matchup or into, into like a secondary? Investing in other I think yeah. it's better to invest into a secondary because you'll have it for other matchups as well. Yeah. But then that, that uh, again, that's a lot more time to put into the game. But I feel like you'll get better. If you're going for results, you'll get better results doing yeah. that. I think, I think the good thing with picking up a secondary or like a dual main is that Especially if you don't really play many other characters, yeah, is that it gives you a more diverse look at the game. Especially if the characters are two completely different from each other, and that they won't. Oh, that was really unfortunate. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, like sometimes you know, playing Falco and then playing uh, like, Fox. Yeah, or, two completely different jump squat times. Yeah, and stuff like your wave shines and everything. Even like, wow, oh. not like this. Not like Bible this. thumb. I mean, so, yeah, I mean, like, even going from, like, Fox, I remember um, Sun 2, when he came here two weeks ago, was saying how he was, he liked to work on a Sheik because Sheik it Fox helped him with his, good, uh, it, it also helped him with his tech chasing on Falco, you know, yeah. because Sheik is very tech chasing every character. Oh, no. Wow. Oh, that was <laughs> not well, the best idea. I mean, the RNG, though. Earlier, I was playing Marth, or I was playing uh, Peach in a friendly, and I pulled two stitches in one game. Oh, my friend got so salty. I mean, I feel like it. If there was a way to nerf it, I feel like you may just a, just a, a turn up have the same amount. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, I, 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 I don't really think. It, I mean, it's. Just I don't really RNG. care about it, but it's just like when people get salty, they really get salty. Yeah, I mean, if you want to complain about RNG, you should look at like Hearthstone or something. That that that's the game where you that's really want to be talking RNG about game. RNG. Yeah. All uh, right, good up there. Good up there. 
And I mean, I'm not going to say this is a lost game. I mean, this is... 120. Yeah. Oh, Shy Guy helped. Insane DI. <laughs> yeah, oh, the no, Shy Guy kind of just knocked him right up. He just needs another forward throw, really. Work. Wow, great DI. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you just got to be so careful. And it's hard to... Especially when... You can get in and do anything. Yeah, especially when Peach has control like this. I mean, there's possibilities of Gimps with, you know, jumping and needling, but it's just so hard when he has so much control over the stage like this. Oh, yeah. and yep, that's going to do it. The game's all right. So, so, winner's finals. JP gets fourth. Yep. Congratulations, JP.